I wonder how many Zionists in the house will denounce the rise of anti-Arab hate because I am doubting they will. The only time a Zionist will denounce any kind of hate is when somebody criticizes the Israeli government. Other than that, they support anti-Semitism. Because when Marjorie Taylor Greene says something anti-Semitic or anyone else uh, in Congress says something anti-Semitic, nobody really says anything. Mr. Speaker, three young college students went for a walk in Burlington, Vermont during their Thanksgiving break. Hisham, Kinan, and Tassin spoke Arabic to one another and wore kafiyas, and they were shot. Whether or not this meets the legal standard for a hate crime, we know this was a hateful act. The recent rise in Islamophobia in this country has led to deadly violence. It's deeply disturbing and frightening. I want to be clear, leaders in this very chamber need to unequivocally denounce the rise of anti-Arab hate and Islamophobia. Words matter. We need to lead with our values, community, and acceptance rather than hatred and fear. No one should be targeted because of their ethnicity or their religion. It has no place in Vermont. It has no place anywhere. We all have a part to play. We need to speak up and stand with our Muslim neighbors and friends now.